and welcome back to Pokemon Platinum. Today we are in Eferna City and there's a blue haired guy because these guys are everywhere. Hey you, yeah you, trainer. Uh, it's okay, never mind, you look tough. I won't take, um, I'll just let you <laughs> keep your Pokemon carry on. <laughs> He's so suspicious. It feels great riding a bike with the wind in your face, doesn't it? I wouldn't know, my mom never gave me a bike. Even though it would have been really useful. Oh, Barry! I didn't expect to see you here. And he ran into me again. Hey, can you? You came to see the Pokemon statue, right? I'll take you there. I didn't even know there was a Pokemon statue. But sure, Barry. We'll go see it. <gasps> it's him! It's my dad! It's my dad! My mom didn't want to talk about him. But it's him! It's my dad! He's here! He's here! You know, Barry had the right idea, because ever since I've started my Pokemon journey, I've been seeing my dad a lot. So, this is his learner's Pokemon statue. His name is even Cyrus. He's so cool, my dad. Shaping our world, our time and space in an intertwining spiral. Revered in Sinnoh are the Pokemon of time and space. Sinnoh Smith, its truth needs investigation. Oh, he's an archaeologist. That's how you say that, I think. Hey, Dad. No, Dad, don't ignore me. Don't, Dad. Dad, I want to be an archaeologist like you. Oh, hey, Barry Sills. When we smacked together, a brilliant flash of inspiration came to me. Is it hard to get my dad back, Barry? Oh, an easy way to become a great trainer. Yeah, that. No, that wasn't what I was thinking, but okay. Alright, listen close. Make certain all your attacks hit. Avoid enemy attacks, for sure. If you do that, you'd never lose. You'd be the invincible trainer. Anyway, go check out the Pokemon chairs that you see you around. You know, Barry has the right idea. He basically got my idea for Pokemon training. Always hit, hit first, never get attacked, kill them. The Therna City's Pokemon statue. There seems to have been a descriptive plate, but it seems torn off. Mm. That must be sad about it having been defaced. Oh, it's an awesome Pokemon from long, long ago. Hey, you there, kid! Stay away from that Pokemon statue. Team Galactus is conducting an official inves investigation. That hurt my brain. I hope my dad doesn't run into them. That'd be pretty bad if he's an archaeologist and they're weird stealing people. Etherna came to be long ago in honor of ancient Pokemon. Though many things have changed, what is important has not. I hope it remains that way forevermore. You know, that's typical of an old man to say. Jeez, what's the world coming to? Someone ripped off the descriptive play from the Pokemon statue. Now no one can read the description. Why would someone do that? Actually, want to know what it said? I do, kid. I can tell my dad the next time I see him. He clearly didn't get to see it. Um, the first inscription went like this, sort of. Creation of the air. Give off time. In laughter, there's tears. And likewise, the same time flows the blessing of the air. Yikes. I've forgotten big <laughs> jokes of this. Do you want to hear the other description? <laughs> this kid, he's just like me forgetting stuff. Yes, I will. Birth of Pal, creator of parallel dimensions, alive yet not alive, rifts in space to arrive in the same universe. He can't even remember that it said universe, but he can remember universe. The blessings of Pal. <laughs> oh, he saw of people talking about a third description. You know, kid. I'm pretty sure there probably is. You know, things always come in threes, especially here in Sinnoh. The blue-haired people. Are there three blue-haired people in this town? Yes, there um... Oh! I'm being accosted by a lady with weird things in her hair. Oh, the device you have. Is it a Pokedex? Wow, it brings back some memories. Pardon me, but what's your name? Mm. Oh! Okay. Hello, Kanyo. I'll be sure to remember that name. My name is Cynthia. I'm a trainer just like you. I 
been studying Pokemon mythology lately. Just out of curiosity. Oh, she she's an archaeologist like my dad. Hey, you guys should meet up and share notes. Here in the Thunder City, there's a statue of an ancient Pokemon. Have you seen it already? According to myth, it was an extremely powerful Pokemon. Who knows, you may encounter something like it while you're traveling with your Pokedex. Oh, I know! You should try using this! It should be helpful! And I obtained... Obtained... HMO1. Remember, the hidden move cut can be used in the field. It will let you go places that you were previous... That were previously inaccessible to you. That's important for pilling... For pilling up your Pokedex, right? Yep. Then luck be with you, young trainer. Oh, that's one last thing. Please give my regards to Professor Rowan. She knows the old creepy dude. I wonder if she was once a kid who was accosted by that old man and forced to do labor for him. Okay, what do we have here? No, no, I don't want your herbs. No. Oh, I, I, I know why my Pokemon don't like... No. No, 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 no. I don't want your drugs. Nope. Nope, I don't want anything made from herbs. Have you seen our building? Team Galaxy is so striking rich that we have <laughs> that we can have one built instantly. What a weirdo. Ooh, the underground man's house. Let's check him out later. My friend said Team Galactic took his favorite Pokemon away. I don't think he's telling the truth. Team Galactic looks cool. They don't look like common thugs. I mean, they got blue hair like me. That's kind of cool, but... Ah, it's the wrong shade of cool. I don't trust them. And what is this? A bike shop! Hey! The manager has gone off to the Team Galactic building and hasn't returned. I wonder what's holding him up. They're probably making a big deal out of bikes. I don't know what's so special about bikes. Hello? Let, let me speak to you. No, let me speak to you! <laughs> it's not a city, not anything like it was before. Way back in the birthday. I I guess you are an old person. Things change. This that Team Galactic building went up. The city's atmosphere has gotten all creepy and tense. I don't know what know what those people are doing up in that place. They're probably stealing people's Pokemon. They're they're creepy like that. Oh wow, I was zoning out. She just gave me the TM recycle. Okay. <laughs> Ah, I've got you now! I'm gonna take your flag! Oh, these sub kids. Look at them running around the table. Oh, don't tell me you don't have an explorer kit. You should have a word with the man next door to the Pokemon Center. Um, excuse me, lady. Don't be rude, okay? Oh, hello, scientist. <gasps> no, it's Lucas' dad! Are you the one who taught him how to murder people? You are! I've come a long way to help you on your adventure at the professor's behest. Can you let me ask you, how many Pokemon have you met? I have met 40 Pokemon. It's so many different. Ooh, an XP share. I can use that later. Thank you. Let's just, um... You guys really aren't gonna let me pass through just because I, I can't afford a bike. That's real nice of you. Let's go into this house instead. There's literally no one here. I wonder if this is where my dad lives. Mm, I don't want to talk to you right now. I want, I want, how do I get in here? Yeah. Ooh! Pokeball, you are mine. And it's a super potion. Hi! I got a super potion. Hello, lady. Who are you? Hi, I'm Gardenia. I'm this town's gym leader. My last challenger was this awfully speedy young guy. That's Barry. <laughs> Actually, his name was Barry. He told me about you. He said another challenger's on the way. So that made me angsty. And my gym. No one gets to battle with the gym leader. Me. Until the end. The challenger has to beat all the other gym trainers first. 
I've been waiting for you in the back, Twina. Don't disappoint me. Oh, no, 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 I didn't mean to go in. Sorry, Gadidia lady. Uh, I didn't mean to challenge you yet. Team Galactic is in a building. We want your Pokemon. You know, Team Galactic is very complacent with what they want. Like, like this guy. He's like, um, I just let you, let you keep your Pokemon. If you didn't look strong, I would have taken them. It's the same with this dude. They are real creeps. Okay, did this guy just get a... Look, look, look. Small chin, big chin. Small chin, big chin. Big chin, small chin. <laughs> the underground man's house. Going down for an adventure. This must be the archaeology guild, guild where I can become an archaeologist like, like, just like my old man. Hello. All I ever on earth are armor skulls. My body only digs up skull fossils. I just had a dialectic moment now. I wonder why that happened. It doesn't matter though. I can swap them with my body. A similar leather Pokemon hold an armor fossil and trade it to him. The underground tunnel goes everywhere. Grab your friends and let's play together using DS wireless communications. That is it. pretty much impossible for me. Let's dig up some treasure. I'm from Arbot. I work in the mining machine there. I got advice from the underground man on digging up treasure and spheres. Before I get digging, let me share this advice with you. While you're digging, you may uncover dark rocks. They are very hard. If you keep hitting them, the wall will collapse. If, don't forget that you, that you can die from digging up fo fossils and stones and stuff. Okay, I won't forget. I am. I am the first to have gone underground and dug up some tunnels. You can call me the underground man. Everyone else does, just like the poem of Frizzer. I'll make a gift of this to you. Hold up your end of the deal and put to good use. And I obtained the explorer kit, my step to becoming an archaeologist. My gift to you, the explorer kit, will instantly take you underground. You only need to use it, and you will be down in the tunnels. The underground is a different world, where you can do this, that, and the other thing too. Let me mentor you into becoming a full-fledged spelunker. Spil will you take on that challenge? Not yet. I hope to teach your youngsters about the charms of the underground tunnel, but I can't force you to accept my proposal if you're not inclined. Sorry, I get so lonely sometimes. Okay, I can just take the challenge later. Because right now, right now, we've explored the whole city, we've seen what it has to offer, we've seen the statue that my dad was interested in. But I think maybe Team Galactic stole from the plate and the inscription before I could get here and read it for himself. So, um, I'm thinking we're going to challenge the gym. But my Pokemon have had some embarrassing moments. Some really embarrassing moments. First, our pal got defeated in our first gym challenge. And then we fought that Lady Mars. And both Elokard and our pal had a really hard time. So I'm thinking. I want to go train, and I have a weird memory that I can actually go train this way. Do a bit of exploring. Wait, what did it say? History living. Here we are, wow, two, one, one. And I believe you can actually go on further. Man here and a wax smash that I did not bring with me. See how Mount Cornet towers above us. I want to be big like that one day. I don't know why you would want to be as tall as a mountain, but like mood. <gasps> what is grass vessel? I mean, it's got 55 accuracy. I think I'll pass on the 
on the sleep move. Yeah, sorry, Alucard. <laughs> you loom before me like a giant presence. Uh, Mount Karnet has, has long been known as an ancient and mysterious mountain. Let's go get a Pokemon with Rock Smash real quick. Alrighty then. Do you, dude? Use Rock Smash! And let me just switch Alucard out for Owl Prowl. Owl Prowl need, need some levels. He's on level 19. Hello! <laughs> Who are you? All these beautiful wings. Did, did this person just show me a bucket of chicken wings? Oh no! It was a bucket of actual birds! But the food parts of them. No, don't talk about that when you have Alpha out loud. That's no, that, that's no good. Let's just get this over with. Oh no, poor Alpha. Imagine having an insensitive trainer that just talks about eating you. Ah. Oh, you. I'm going to peck you for that. Is she going to kiss me? I mean, I wouldn't say no, but you know, please don't kiss me. And I got a move called Taunt. Let's go up and taunt her a bit. Hey, you. Hey, you. You who wants to kiss me. Why don't you try it? I dare you. I dare you. I saw a thing up here. That's probably a trainer. Let's see. It was a trainer. So bad. Doesn't that sound like a ninja bursting from cover? I know it's the word or the sound. So bad. Sounds like that, but um. Kid, I'll agree for you. Oh, I love Subash. Look at them. Look at it. It's so cute and adorable, and I just love it. Oh, it's so cute. Ah! Oh no, it's a vampire just like Alucard. It's even got more teeth than Alucard's got. Oh, this kid got more Subats. Does this kid only have Subats? Because if that's the case, then this is the kid of my dreams. This is the kid I want to be when I grow up. Oh, my Subat tree stars. I see. This kid even got a ninja headband on. See any of these holes for items? And I found a great ball. That is a very great ball. <laughs> I'm so dumb! Hello, Meditite! Mount Carnet! Let's go inside and see the mountain that old dude was talking about. I wonder if there's items here. There's definitely an item up there! <laughs> this thing's cry! The little... it, it reminds me of Harry the Platypus! That's what it reminds me of! <laughs> Where's this thing? Harry the platypus! <laughs> I can't get over the fact that they sound like Parry the platypus. And I got an ice heal. That's a bit useless right now, but uh, I got it. And there's some. Um... Oh, it's that does. I didn't expect that to be an item, but thank you! It's a big boulder. A Pokemon may be able to push it aside. Yeah, it's not broken, so I can't work smash it. So I cannot get further in here. I guess the only thing left to do because I can't... Let's see. Let's see. Hmm. Yeah, they're all in their 20s. I, I guess this is enough training. What do you say, little rock climb man? Let's go challenge the gym. You know, if not for the fact that I already planned out my team in advance, I would have totally put Metatide on my team just because it sounds like Perry the Platypus. Because that's hilarious. Hello, man! Hey there, how's it going, champ to be? Actually, that's what I said to some boy who sipped in here earlier, too. The gym leader, Gardenia, is a use of grass type Pokemon. It should be obvious, but grass type Pokemon really hate fire. There are also a huge disadvantage against the flying type too. Oh wait a second, I should tell you about the gym itself first. You can't challenge the gym leader until you beat all the trainers. It's a bit challenging, but I think, think but just think of it as good training and go for it. Thank you. Let's actually get juice box in the front. Because our pearl is going to have a hard time in here, except our pearl does have pack. So uh, let's put our pearl in second place here. Alucard, you're going to the back burner. 
Yay, she will actually fight me. Welcome. Without further ado, let's go. Yes, lady, let's go. A cherubi. I see, a little girl. Goosebox, you will be a man of your word and sweep this entire gym. Gust them out the window. Uh, ah, almost had it. Almost had it. Did this thing just put seeds on my juice box? These vampires got just as beautiful lashes as Alucard does. Juice box, ignore it. This isn't, this isn't Alucard. Alucard would never be our opponent. Alucard is too beautiful and um, pretty for that. And down. Ooh, that's a lot of XP! Level 22! Stockpile! What is stockpile? Uh, the use of charges are power and raises both the defense and spell defense. The move can be used three, three times. Let's again minimize. This was a really hard choice for me because I both like evasion but I also really like critical hit. So, um. I'm going to be working on the hands of this flower club. How utterly bizarre and strange to see this thing spinning. Whoop, whoop. Imagine seeing this in real life. Okay. That took a long time, but um, I guess that's fine. Oh, that. Oh, I did jump. I was like, that looked like I jumped, but that's because I did. My quest type Pokemon can dole out some serious special attacks. I want you when you let you win easily. Don't worry, little lady. I am sure you will be a challenge. Oh, she's got magic. And a body. Look at that little vampire baby. So cute. Oh, that little vampire baby. That poor baby. It's probably got like one, one HP left. Oh, that's not gonna do a lot, baby. Oh. You know, I was sympathetic. I'm not sympathetic anymore. The moment the paralyze kicks in, I stop all sympathies. I go cold turkey. I am mean now. Thank you, juice box. Kick that baby out the window, please. Throw it out. Put it in the trash. Where it lands, it lands. As long as it gets out the window. Another booty. Actually, let's let Owl Prowl show his hourly abilities to kill the small baby animals. You are going to eat this baby and you are going to like it, Owl Prowl. Owl Prowl does like it, except for the stunning spores. I never like the stunning spores. They make me want to wing the other Pokemon's neck, even though I like using it myself. And another baby. This one? This one, the first one got out, went out the window. The second one got eaten by our crowd. This baby can be murdered in front of you. I mean, the second baby was too, but you know. Oh lord, I know a new uh, battle against a uh, three paralyzing booties could be so infuriating. But at least I'll probably leveled up from this. <sighs> Hello, Jenna. Yes, yes, the more beautiful the flower the faster it will do whatever it was. Is that? Yes, 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 yes. So the clock moves and the fountain stops sprouting when I went. Let's just um, wait the how Oh hey! I didn't have to wait all that long. Thank you for the short wait time. Oh oh this the the water sprouts went down so I could go heal. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean I should heal, but uh let's just uh Let's start fate! You can't win when you're distracted by the lovely aromas of Pokemon. What if you have a smelly Pokemon? Then it's not lovely, but it is just as distracting. And it's done. 
Oh, I'm so happy that this, these gym trainers are all gone now. Now I don't have to worry about this anymore. And I defeated a woman lady something something and she said something, but I was blinking when she said it because... Ooh. There's only the gym leader left. Go on. Don't be afraid. I will never be afraid of a gym leader. Thank you very much. Why couldn't it just open straight ahead so I could go out and then I go in straight on? Imagine thinking that people can't just go through sprouting water. Alrighty then, it's time for Gardenia and this time, this time, I will not make any grand statements about how this will be easy because I will only end up embarrassing myself like the last times. You kept me waiting. I'm a furnace. Okay, let's take that from the top. I'm a furnace gym leader, Gardenia, the grass type master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My heart was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So, anyway, this will be fun. Let's have our battle. She's really nice. I like her. Ooh. Is she wearing a poncho? She is. This is a girl after. She's wearing a poncho that looks like my poncho. It's, except my poncho is stitched in the middle. She's got a touch wig even. And it's level 20, okay? Game face on and all that. Should yes, yes. Let's make ourselves defensive. Okay, stock pilot one. Yes, special defense and defense. And you're using reflect. That is defense. Okay. You stock pilot again. Okay, okay. Let's see what you will do, Tetrick. Sunny day. Sunny day. That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad for me, I think. Let's do one focus energy and then begin attacking. I'm thinking. Where's the leaf? Shouldn't do much. Please don't do much. Thank you. It's not very effective. I want juice box to sweep this entire team. Okay, I can only waste my thing once. Okay. Sunlight is wrong, I know. Thank you, sun. I know that you are doing your sun thing. Okay, let's try the ghost. I think ghost is maybe a physical move. So, if it has. Okay, the reflect wore off, so that's something at least. Let's use ghost again. First Pokemon is down. This is my game face. I'm thinking I'm not talking. This is bad for our let's play. Tear him. Okay, we're going to keep in juice box. I'm going to try for the juice box sweep. Okay, this thing is going to open up because of the sunlight. Unless the sunlight wore off. But I don't think it did. At least I didn't see it wearing off. They've got... Okay... A mystical wheel. I don't know what that does. I know a lot about Pokemon, but I don't know what moves do. Hey, we're almost the same color here. The two purple Pokemon with a weird thing on top too. Super potion. Gardenia, how could you do this to me? How could you make me hit you more times? Ooh, a critical hit. Yes. It helped that I pumped myself up. Am I actually going to sweep the gym leader here? Because if so, one, that would be really amazing. Two, I wouldn't be getting bounced again. Okay. Okay, now, now now's the big boy. Rosa Wade. Rosa Wade. This is a dangerous thing. It is not the end yet, she says. And that is the truth. Okay, let's try. Stun Spore. Of course it's Stun Spore. The whole gym has been about Stun Spores so far. Of course she does it too. Why not? Why wouldn't she? Ah! <laughs> oh, Stun Spore, how I hate it. Oh, let's see how much there. Okay, okay. 
Okay, that basically did nothing. Let's see. Okay, where's the weight? You're going down slowly. I'm going to wield you down bit by bit. Where's the weight? And when I do, you will not come out alive. Okay. Oh. Did you just eat a citrus berry? <laughs> Are you saying something? You think you have me cornered? Yes, Gardenia. I didn't think that I had you cornered. But apparently not. Or maybe I will get a critical hit and it will be over. One hit. Please. Please. Juice box. Defeat this vampire. Throw this vampire out in the trash with the booty we fought on earlier. Out the window. Come on. Come on. No. Not yet. A bit more. A bit more. They, this is turning just as embarrassing as the last year, by the way. Because even though Juice Box hasn't been defeated yet, this is still pretty embarrassing, okay? I mean, it wouldn't be so embarrassing, actually. I could have just healed him then and I wouldn't have the low HP and stuff. Ooh, almost a thousand EXP! And I- Amazing! You're very good, aren't you? Oh, she's praising me and I can see her stomach. I just noticed that. <laughs> <laughs> I might have said it before, but you're really tough. Wasn't it hard for you to raise your Pokemon to be so good? I guess that's the measure of how much you love your Pokemon. In recognition of that, I proudly grant you this. And I got the forest badge. Actually, it wasn't that hard raising my Pokemon. Let me just um, twiddle my thumbs a bit. Is it... Oh, no, no, I will flip my hair in an arrogant manner. With the forest badge. The Pokemon can use the hidden move cut outside of battle. Now. Now that... <laughs> I keep putting a comma after now, in, even though it's a full sentence. Now that you have two gym badges, all Pokemon you received in trades will obey you up to level 30. I've also got something else. It's a gift for me. TM... 68. 86, I mean. West Nut. One of your favorite moves. You didn't even use... Grass not on me. But I, I guess thank you for the move. So why don't we end it here? We defeated Gardenia Ola. Let's do a little jump. 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 And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Nice and bright. You know? I don't think I like Eternal City's music. It makes me really, really sleepy. And I am very much a slave to music that makes me sleepy. <laughs> Did it again? I found one again!